Good day, everyone. I'm meteorologist Adam Kolpak. We've got a cold night ahead. There's actually a storm system off to the northwest. A lot of this energy is going to stay to the west of us tonight into tomorrow, but it's going to come close enough to give maybe a few rain or even wet snow showers for some areas west of the Cascades. Here's that system as it dives to the south. We've already got cold air in place. It's the next area of energy that's going to give us a possibility for some snow showers here in the Rogue Valley for Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. And right now we could see another trace to possibly an inch of snow for the Rogue Valley again Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. If there's some changes, we'll give you some updates on that. Our pinpoint forecast, though, shows those snow showers diminishing overnight tonight, but it's going to be cold. And in some areas along and east of that, uh, the Cascades, it's going to be frigid. You can see some rain showers out there, especially for the coastal areas. And then we may even see some rain or wet snow showers during the day west of the Cascades. Otherwise, we'll see clouds mixing in possibly with some sunshine. The next area of energy moves in later Tuesday night and Wednesday morning, giving us a possibility for some snow showers even here in the Rogue Valley. Right along the coast, it looks like it should be rain showers, but either way, it's going to be chilly. That system moves off to the south and southeast Wednesday morning, so the snow showers and rain showers should diminish. Get a little break on Wednesday, potentially into Thursday. Our forecast for the coast, freeze warnings in effect from midnight tonight through 9 a.m. Tuesday. So we've got cold temperatures, lows in the 20s and 30s. And for tomorrow, there's a possibility for a few showers, maybe even a slight chance for snow showers. Lows, as you can see on this map, generally 20s through the 30s, highs tomorrow in the 40s. I have 32 and 45 for Brookings. As we move inland, lows will be in the teens and 20s. This evening, there could be a few leftover snow showers, otherwise just cold temperatures. Clouds may mix in with some sunshine tomorrow during the day here in Medford at 20 and 42 and moving east of the Cascades. Colder still, a low of zero for Alturas, three below for Lakeview and highs will generally be in the teens and 20s, some areas making into the 30s. We have clouds mixing in with some sunshine during the day on Wednesday. So the cold temperatures continue, especially at night. And that chance for some snow showers Tuesday night into Wednesday diminishing as rain or wet snow showers. I'm putting in some breaks right now for Thursday and Friday, but there's more chances for rain and snow Saturday and a chance for rain and snow showers on Sunday. And for the Klamath Basin, our temperatures will be in the 30s to around 40, a chance for snow showers Wednesday and then a chance for snow on Saturday, chance for leftover snow showers on Sunday. And also some pretty cold temperatures for you to start out Mount Shasta City. Your highs low in the 30s and 40s. There is a chance for some snow showers Tuesday night, diminishing into Wednesday. Another chance for snow on Saturday and a chance for snow showers on Sunday. And for the coast, our low temperatures will be on the chilly side, but you can see highs generally in the 40s to around 50. There is a slight chance for possibly some rain showers on Tuesday, maybe even some wet snow showers in the morning, and a chance for leftover showers on Wednesday, another chance for rain on Saturday, and a chance for showers on Sunday.